the faculty are here to help you. It's one of their jobs. And again, at least at a, at a place like CG, we want to do that job. Um, but it probably is up to you to take the initiative because the faculty have a bunch of advisors and a lot of other jobs. <laughs> they're doing their own research, they're teaching classes, they're helping to administer the organization, um, and they have external things they're doing for their professional organizations. And so it's just important, again, to remember, they're there for you, they want to help you, um, but you probably have to be the one who actually comes and knocks on the door or makes the appointment and do it. <laughs> Have faith that your advisor is looking out for your best interest and absolutely wants the best for you. Give them the opportunity to be there for you, be honest with them, and let them be your champion. And if you go in there with positive expectations, you'll be surprised how your advisor will often rise to those expectations. A lot of people feel like professors' times is precious, and I don't want to, in you know, insert myself, and that I'm bothering them by saying I want to come visit you and talk with you. And um, I just feel like it's our job, you know, to get to know our students. How can you be a good advisor if you don't even know the person? You know, particularly in helping people find jobs or putting them in contact with people. You know, I often tell people, I refer them to somebody, oh, contact this person, tell them I'm, you know, or I'll write on behalf and say, I want to introduce you to this student. She's interested in X or he's interested in X. So I just think that's what students should be uh, not afraid to be more proactive. I just would like to reiterate the importance of peers and how important it is to have a, um, a peer group or at least one peer who you can feel accountable to and who will support you no matter what. A peer I had in graduate school who I met on the very first day of graduate school, we took many classes together, we uh, did assignments together, we both, we both graduated around the same time. We both got tenure track jobs. We started re doing research together. We've published together. We've gotten grants together, and we just published a book together. Uh, so this is someone I've, I've you know, I have a, as a lifelong friend and peer and colleague um, that I met on the very first day of graduate school. So I think students should do their very best to develop those relationships because when no one else understands what they're going through, whether it's their family or their kids or their employer or even their advisor, that peer will always get it, I think, and will be able to offer support. You're coming in for with a purpose, right? And you, you as a student need to advocate on your own behalf to make sure that you're getting what you need out of the program. And we as faculty want to provide that too. So, you know, if, if, if the faculty seem to be leading you in a direction that, that is not the direction you want, you should push back on that and, and, and respectfully, you know, try to, to pursue the, the path that you want to pursue. I see students as, as they have the power to, to shape their own destiny, right? And, and they don't necessarily always see it, but, um, you know, it's, it's, really, it's their life, right? It's their, it's their topic, it's their life, it's their uh, dissertation, it's their career. Your advisor is there to help you. And uh, as part of the process, be engaged, be uh, proactive about seeking that help uh, because it's something that really will, uh, in the long term, benefit your career trajectory, your progress through the program. And, uh, and I think it's something that um, some people may view it as intimidating or they don't, they don't necessarily want to bother their advisor because they're so busy. Uh, and I wouldn't take that orientation. I would say if you need help, if you need assistance, then please uh, reach out to them and, and seek that guidance. We want you to succeed. So whatever helps you, we can help you do it. When we invited you to join the CGU Community of Scholars, we were confident in your ability to successfully earn your PhD. Your success is our success, and we hope that you now feel more confident in your ability to navigate your journey from coursework to completion.